So hello and welcome to my channel guys you're watching tech care on and in this video we're going to write our own version of the string function which is used to compare two string in the C programming I know you are probably thinking why we have to write the code of these functions we can just use the predefined version of them by adding the string dot as library but if you are a beginner you should write the code of these function on your own it will help you to understand the basic of the C programming and how these function work under the hood so let me give you a small description of this function it return 1 if the first string is greater than the second string and it return minus 1 if the second string is greater than the first string and 0 if the both strings are equal so what's the greater means here what's the greater uh, word referring to and i'll tell you the answer in a minute so let's first start with the main function so we are declaring two string because of course we need two string to compare now let's check the input of these strings from the user Now we'll call our string function, which is strcmp, and it will take two arguments, which is the strings, to compare, and it will return an integer value. So we have to declare an integer value to store the returning value, and now we'll just print the value of this integer variable. So that's our main function. Now we have to make our strcmpy function. It's gonna be of integer type, and strcmpy is gonna be the name of this function, and it will take two arguments, which is the string. So the first string is ptr one, and it have it should be a pointer. Second is character pointer ptr two. So now let me tell you the working of the code and answer to our previous question. So this function will compare these two string character by character. That's the surface line. what's under it is it will compare the ascii value of each individual character of these strings so let's suppose there is two string first is tech and the second is aron what the string function will do it will compare the ascii value of first non matching character of these strings like t in the first string and a in the second string are not equal so it will compare the ascii value of these two characters and whichever is greater wins the race and it will not go further comparing these two strings to the end it will just stop here and return one because t is in the first string and if the string first is greater than the string two it should return one so that's what's going to happen here we we'll start a while loop to the end of the first string and then we'll compare each character of these two strings if the first character in both the strings are equal then we'll just move on to the next character and if the character in the first string is greater than the character in the second string then it will return one and if the character in the second string is greater then it will return minus 1 and if none of the return statement will encounter that means all the character of these two strings are equal and in that case we'll just return zero that means the strings are equal so that's the code of our function let's try to run this code so first string is going to be tech and the second string is aron and as expected it is returning 1 because the t and a are not equal second example So that's all for today guys I hope you enjoy my video watch the other videos on our channel and subscribe to our channel for more updates thanks for watching and I will see you next time